When we think of slavery, we imagine olden times when the need for labor was solved by capturing those unfortunates bought and sold as chattels. We think of the cotton fields and the pyramids and are comforted to know slavery has long been over. Or has it? Slaves. What is a slave? Someone forced to work for no wages. It has happened throughout the ages. No time off. No perks. No choice in the matter. Forced and beaten, leaving all behind. Though no contract was signed and hardly anything eaten. There was no end in sight. Worst of all, it must be said. The work never finished, all day and night. The only respite was undead, when at last the chains were removed and the corpse was buried in its final bed while the master looked on, unmoved. Today, there are no slaves in the fields and the masters are not in plantations. They have all moved to the city dressed in fashions thought pretty, and yet there are slaves in all nations. The iron chains were removed, the mentality was altered. Slaves think themselves free, but are still shackled to the whipping tree by mortgages and debts that mustn't be faulted. We are high on a false drug called freedom, yet it's another iron chain that imprisons also fashions and false needs that are just cheap colored beads tie the new slaves down and also conditions to think we need more and newer toys to think we need brands to be someone to make us feel important to give us poise brainwashed into submission and enslaved with no need for a gun to keep us working for more more of the same empty baubles. We jealously look at each other to keep score. In the news our attention is diverted with international squabbles. There is little difference indeed between the slaves of yesteryear and us now, the slaves of today. We too work and must do till doomsday, bound by chains of debt which take our lifetime to clear.